Do you guys ever have any trouble with your trailer lights kind of flickering on and off as you're going down the road? Well, watch this video. Hey there outdoor YouTubers, it's Dave Knetter for Knetter's Practical Outdoors. Alright, here's the scenario. Your trailer lights work, but every time you go down the road, they're kind of flickering on and off. Alright, um, and, and I mean all of them. Uh, your brakes are flickering on and off when you're using your brakes. Your running lights are flickering on and off when you're using your running lights. Now, of course, your blinkers are supposed to flicker on and off, okay? So we're not really talking about them. But, but all the other circuits. The, uh, the brakes and the running lights, they just flicker as you're going down the road. Okay, well, if that's your problem, it's going to be something common to all those circuits, right? And that one thing that's common to all those circuits is the return wire, okay? The white wire, the ground wire, the negative wire. That's the wire that's responsible for returning all the other circuits back to the vehicle, back to the negative of the battery. Well, what would you even check for if the lights are all working as the trailer is sitting in your driveway? Well, you want to check for a loose wire or maybe even a loose connection at the plug. All right. Follow this white wire back. Wiggle it as the lights are on. Say you got your brake lights on. Wiggle this white wire. See if that causes the lights to flicker. Uh, wiggle it on the, the trailer side and the truck side. All right. And then go ahead and just kind of wiggle and twist on the plug and see if that causes the lights to flicker or go on and off. So if doing that wiggling of the wires and the plug doesn't lead you anywhere, go ahead and try this. With the trailer plugged in, uh, either have the brake lights or the running lights on, and then go ahead and lift the trailer off the hitch. Now, if your lights go out at that point, you definitely have a problem with the ground wire between the frame of your trailer and the frame of your truck. So what's happening is, this white wire or this plug just aren't doing their job in the circuit. So the circuits are actually taking the path back through the coupler on top of the ball. And that's why when you lifted it off, the circuit was broken and the lights went out. All right. Now, I think you guys can imagine, like the coupler on top of the ball is not a dependable electrical connection. And that's why as you're going down the road and it's chattering back and forth, that's why the lights are flickering in and out. So you might have to go back to those white wires, all right? Go to the white wire that attaches to the frame of your trailer, uh, take it off, clean it up, reconnect it. You might have to go back to the white wire that attaches to the frame of your truck, take that off, clean it, reconnect it. Or you might have to go to the plug, clean the plug up, or maybe you have to replace the plug. Now, for this video, what I did is I disconnected the white wire from the frame of the trailer, and that's why the lights went out when I lifted it off the hitch. And keep this in mind if you're checking the continuity from the trailer frame to the truck frame with a meter, right? Okay, you guys are like, okay, Kinetter said we got to have continuity, good uh, low ohm reading from the trailer frame to the truck frame for these lights to work. So you check it with a meter, but it's kind of the same scenario. You're going to want to lift the trailer off of the hitch when you make that check to ensure that your meter is reading through the white wire which is designed to carry those other circuits. Now, if you are unclear about any of this stuff or any other trailer light issues that you might be having, all right, I have a whole series of videos on how to fix your trailer lights. All right, go to my channel, Kinetter's Practical Outdoors, and I have a trailer light playlist there. Go and check that out. I have videos on how to use a meter, okay, if you had any questions about, you know, using the meter to check that continuity. I have a video on how to use a meter, how the circuit works, troubleshooting for problems, fixing problems. There's several videos there 
on how to fix your trailer lights. Check it out if you got any questions. All right, guys. And also, remember to hunt, fish, laugh, repeat. This is Dave Knetter from Knetter's Practical Outdoors. Hey, thanks for watching, and God bless.